Yo, what's good, y'all? Coney and Chris back another video. Before I start the video, I want to say one thing about school shootings. What the fuck am I hitting on my chair? What is that? What the fuck? All right, listen. A lot of shootings have been happening regardless of schools, stores, churches, which is crazy to me. Churches that went in elementary school. That's crazy to me. Um, Texas today announced that they're limiting, they're, they're raising the age limit to 21. Y'all have to understand, as long as the black market exists, people will always find ways to get guns. Regardless if they're 10, 13, 16, 20, it doesn't matter if y'all raise the age limit. It does not matter. Now, a lot of people, the weirdos, are getting inspired by the school shooting. Y'all have noticed there's a lot of school shootings that's happening, right? The weirdos are getting inspired off of these weirdos to start shootings. And it's like, it's like these motherfuckers like little group chats. And like, hey, yo, bro, I'm gonna show up to school this day. And then this person says, like, oh, I'm gonna do it this day. If you do it, I'll do it, type shit. That's, that's what's going on, literally, bro. Like, that's what's going on. These niggas are shooting up schools and churches and stores like it's a video game. The first nigga to do that shit recently streamed it on Twitch. And then he did, that person got inspired off of him. Then the next person got inspired off of that person. And so on and so forth. Yeah, there's a lot of them that happen that they don't, we don't talk about as much because there's too many that happen. But the weirdos getting inspired off this shit. So I just want to say, everyone, for your sake, please, please be safe. Please be safe. I always have a gun or a taser on you just for a case. Because people are weird. They will shoot you for no reason. Man, I don't even know your name. He'll shoot you for no reason just because he want to take his anger out. The guy that shot up that elementary school, he literally walked in there with a whole big-ass gun. There was no reason for him to shoot up an elementary school. Those are kids. Those kids are learning 1 plus 1, 2 plus 2, 4 plus 4. Why are you shooting up little kids, bro? And then other people shoot up churches, people's out of their job. That's weird, bro. But yeah, let's get into this video, man. Um, Tri Rags, I don't really react to Tri Rags videos. Probably my first video I react to him. To I love his Red Shirt Guy series. They're really, really funny. But yeah, he's a cool He's a cool TikToker and YouTuber, bro. I fuck with him, you feel me? Let's get into the video, man. Hey, you guys, I'm going to be talking about what to do and to not do in a school shooting situation. <laughs> Okay, the first test question I want to give you guys is what do we do with the desk if the shooter is on the way to the classroom? We flip that bitch over. Listen, I'll flip I'm flipping it over, Monica. You aim over it? What? Who said that? Oh god, here You're we not go. Behind them? Did you say that the first time? No, yeah. he didn't. Uh, yeah, you know, white so people, man. Right Some of these white people, um, man, be shooting up schools. We're behind the desk, you guys, to keep us safe. Uh, the only downside about that situation is is there's a window right there, and it's the only blind spot in that situation. And they examine um, it. Look at him. It's a clean shot if the shooter was to somehow be up on that hill over there. It'll be a clean shot uh, to knock our brains out. But and they can examine it. He's like, oh, yeah. yeah. That nigga plotting. <laughs> he keep looking out the window. So, it should be fine, you guys. Okay, all doors to the classrooms in the school have a lock on the inside. You can lock from the inside, but you cannot unlock it from the outside. Mm. The only way to unlock it from the outside is through a key. And each classroom has a key, you guys. Our key is located on the top shelf inside of the book. It's the only book on the top shelf. The key is inside the book. That's what page of the book is the key in? Oh, my oh, yeah, God. Yeah, I forgot to mention that. It's on page bro. 97. So, yeah, the key, you guys, is inside the book get the key they'll be able to unlock the door from the outside um can this one key unlock all the doors oh in the school? my god yeah that's what i'm talking about it's like and, it, and then some of these niggas actually do this bro like they actually like get information on the school to shoot up their, their own school can you imagine a nigga shoot up your own school like you see this nigga walking every single day when you like you switching classes and this nigga surprisingly made an ak-47 at school can you imagine a nigga shooting that ak-47 at you you go to the hallway to take a piss. Everybody's in class. You walk out the bathroom. This nigga has an AK-47 and he shoots you. And you're like, what? You just get shot like that. That's what. That's how I be with these niggas, bro. Not every school shooter is white, but majority of them are white. I just, I just want to get as much information out of this as I can, so you know, to to to, to be safe in the situation. I like that. Um, yes. Nigga says safe. Uh, each key can lock every. That nigga plot. Look at his face. That's the good thing about the key. If you have the key, you can unlock another door to another classroom and go inside to be safe. And shoot up that um, classroom. As you see right here is my desk. 
uh, the state is now allowing us teachers to have guns. Because you know what they say? That's a terrible idea, in my opinion. Because I ain't going to lie. I'm sorry if I'm pausing a lot. Y'all going to get used to this pause and shit. I don't care. I'm going to get my, my thoughts on this shit. You feel me? Um, Y'all seen students fighting teachers, right? If you are African American and have went to a bad middle school or high school, such as myself, I have seen niggas and teachers put their hands on each other, <laughs> physical wise, fighting and arguing. You telling me the number one most annoying student won't piss off a teacher with a gun? That's a terrible idea. I don't know who thought of that. Yeah, it's a good thing, but it's a majority of a bad thing because a lot of it's a good thing for like the good schools, you know, like the white schools. They don't really have that much trouble. But if it's a black school, majority of the school is black. These niggas would piss off these teachers, bro. Like, I've seen teachers. My sixth grade teacher literally walked out the class. My sixth grade teacher, math teacher, walked out the class and never came back. The next day, they told us she quit. If she had a gun, she would have shot up the girls in this class, bro. Stop playing with me. Say, you guys, more guns will stop the violence. More bullets will stop more people from being shot. And then this nigga in the classroom, he gonna take the gun. But, um, yeah, this is my desk. Uh, I have the gun inside of the desk. It will be on the and right apply side him, bro. Desk. Inside of a case with a combination lock, with a combination that I know. And, um, um and what is the combination? You hear this nigga? The case that keeps the gun? Oh, of course. The combination is 757. Why would you tell him? 757. 63. 63. 23. 23. <laughs> you ain't for the last numbers. <laughs> you know I can't give the combination to students, silly. <laughs> Man, Timothy is so funny. Okay. His name is Timothy. I should really tell you something. Guys, um, I want you guys to follow me this way. So how hard he's um, breathing? Excuse me. Uh, what would you say is the most secret and best hiding spot in the school? Which place do you think that the most students will be in? <laughs> I like your initiative. <laughs> Follow us this way. I'm going to show you right where it's at. Come on, you guys. Man, you guys need to be like Timothy. No, they know the fuck they don't. Ooh. Hey, listen. Hey, listen, 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 listen. All school shooters, majority of school shooters have been locked away and are being called crazy. These niggas are not crazy. They know what they're doing. They know it. Listen, and then y'all try to blame video games on this. Yeah, some of them play Call of Duty, but all that stuff. But. Video games now, this generation of video games, is mostly Fortnite. It's literally mostly Fortnite. And there ain't no blood in Fortnite. People be like, oh, people who play video games are school shooters. I've been a gamer my entire life. Like, I'm legit a gamer. I've been playing games my entire life. Won, won tournaments in the past. Not one day have I, I, I thought about going to my school and shooting up a classroom. Politicians always do that. They always be like, oh, video games are the reason why school shooters exist. Yeah, okay. So if that's the reason why niggas like Ninja will shoot up a school right now. Because Ninja's literally one of the biggest gamers in our generation. Nick Merckx will shoot up a school right now. Right? Doesn't make any sense, right? But yeah, listen. Just be safe. Everyone everyone be safe. All y'all be safe. School shooters, shooters at work, churches, just be safe. Because nowadays, as of lately, they've been doing a lot. A lot of the shootings have been happening everywhere. And it's really, really, really frustrating hearing about a school, a church, or, or someone at work got shot. It's crazy, bro. A guy shot up a hospital recently, a couple of days ago, because his surgeon said, I mean, he had surgery on his back, and then he was having too much pain, and his surgeon was, his doctor was too busy. He shot a doctor, the pay, a patient, his assistant and somebody else, and then they killed him too. And he was black. But hey, man, more videos coming soon, y'all. Thanks for subscribing. Almost to 500 subscribers. Thank y'all so much for that last MJF video. I'm out, man.